guys, I want you to put your hands together for the next comic. Coming to the stage, we got Pete Nelson coming up right now. Give it up for Pete. Let's keep it going for Don, everybody. Yeah. Hell yeah, everyone stretch out. Reach your hands over your heads. There's still more comedy to be done. I don't know, how are we doing? What kind of a room is this? We got um, a clapping room. That's a good room. I want it to be a clapping room. You know, it's, it's okay, it is every day that I have like, thank you. I have like a bunch of people in a basement that I force to listen to my comedy sets. Just this time it's over here that I'm doing it. <laughs> You know, how are we doing? Is this fun? You guys better be buying shit. That's important. Go and buy things right now. You know, that's that's contingent. This is a free comedy show, you know? But it is $40 if you want to leave, so. Yeah. And just start, you will collect the money at the door, get your wallets out. Any weed heads in here? You smoke some weed? I love weed. I always spend $80 on weed at a time. That's my favorite increment of money to buy weed. You guys know why? Huh? I got you. You got me. What is it? $40. Because <laughs> it's $40. What strain are you smoking today? That's the right strain. I like that. Because uh, it costs four twenties. Ah. See, that joke goes better when you don't talk. I don't know. <laughs> I, uh, I love the stage of the Gnarly Deli. It's my favorite stage because my knees suck. They've been killing me. I had ACL surgery. Anyone have ACL surgery in here? Yep. Ever since I had ACL surgery, my knees are killing me. For those of you who don't know what ACL surgery is, it stands for adjusted cock length. <laughs> Now this thing is so big and heavy, carrying it around all day. Man, my knees are killing me, you know? Okay. <laughs> this chick took one look at it, and she's like, Peter, I want to make a mold of your penis. I was like, why? It's covered in mold already. <laughs> You guys are holding in laughter when, when I could sense that. Just laugh out loud. Clap for me on my behalf. I, I order you to clap. That's something. What's going on? Is there a gas leak in here? Is there some sort of... I, I was tripping on mushrooms all night. I'm drinking more than I typically do, and I smoked three joints right before the show. So whatever you feel like is probably somewhere... Uh, I, I don't know, I lost the sense to perceive somewhere in my day. I've been picturing everyone's set as coming out of this guy tonight. <laughs> this guy just looks like he's here to tell a better set than me. Look at this guy, he's the life of the party. We got pissed off tree. This is fun. You think it's originally going to be like a tree that's like, ooh, spooky. But no, his hands are up. He's like, what the fuck did you just do? What the fuck, man? He's got his hands up. He's it's pissed off Trey. And then we got coming Shrek. This guy totally just achieved climax and then they took the Polaroid. He's never worn a witch hat the entire Shrek series that I've known him. But you know, if you can picture him in a, in a witch hat, you can picture him coming, right? I'm just trying to read your minds right now. How many of you guys have COVID-19? Anyone down here with COVID-19? Anyone ever said the word COVID-19 during a bit? Is that a thing? Do you guys do that here? I feel like COVID-19 is like the female orgasm. Everyone says it's there, but I've never seen it myself, you know? Man, you guys just don't fucking laugh in here. Is that everyone? Let's get together on a Tuesday night. I get it. It's a fucking Tuesday. Is this going to be the best? No. There's a very literally low ceiling at a Tuesday night comedy show. It's not going to be fun tonight. Fuck tonight. It's Tuesday. I'm going to go out. Your serious nights are Friday and Saturday, as with everyone's, right? 
Wednesdays are even somehow cooler than a Tuesday night. What happened to the week? They don't call it the strong for a reason. Jesus fucking Christ. The, uh, oh, he, oh, you know, the coolest thing, we got a low ceiling for, like, how good our comedy can be, but this is the only place I've ever performed that has a bell that tells you exactly how many people were walked before your show. Before you go on, I counted 15 people left this place before I could go on. How do I know? I know specifically it was dong every single fucking time. Thanks, guy with the laptop. Yeah, can we... How do... I'm surprised he's smart enough to walk down the stairs to like, I don't know. How does he, was, uh, clap for the guy on the laptop. How many of you guys just enjoyed that, right? No, stop it. I hate all of you. Lock the doors and release the gas. <laughs> I, uh, I drink too much, I smoke too much. I always, I always have cotton mouth, but I'm always horny. So I end up giving like cotton oral. You ever give, and then I smoke weed with my partners. Oh, is he gay? Is he not? Who knows? Maybe I don't even know, you know? <laughs> Imagine if you got like cotton pussy and cotton mouth, it's a problem. Cotton oral, it's dry, it's not fun. Yeah, this guy's shaking his head. When's the last time you gave cotton head before? Not a good look, not fun. My mouth's dry right now as I'm saying this. Was there a point to that bit? No, just cotton mouth oral. All right, guys. Yes. <laughs> I love how Johnny Cat's entire vibe is just like a dude poking you in the sternum, you know? <laughs> it's just like, listen here, punk. <laughs> I know these things. Uh, you guys have a Planet Fitness in town. Yep. Planet Fitness is fun because uh, it's cheap. Ladies, never date a guy who goes to Planet Fitness, because that means not only does he have a small dick, but he's also poor, you know? Um, for those of you who don't know me, oh, I, I should probably do a promo. Tomorrow night, I'm doing my paranormal show here. Please tell your friends. It's a real life uh, storytelling show about people's real life experiences with the unknown. Ghosts, Bigfoot, UFOs, astral projection, dream travel. Have you ever moved a pen with your mind? Do you think your ex-boss was uh, possessed? Any of this shit goes. Tell me what you don't understand about your life as a show. It's here tomorrow night at 7 o'clock. It's called Paranormal Open Mic. Please follow it on Instagram at Paranormal Open Mic. My name is Pete. I'm not a fan of reincarnation. You guys know why? Because who likes to repeat themselves, you know? <laughs> All right, some of you guys didn't laugh at that, so I'll just do that one one more time. My name's Pete. Yeah. 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 I'm not a fan of reincarnation. You guys know why? Why, Pete? Because who likes to repeat themselves? Thank you. You guys are beautiful. See you tomorrow night.